Hey, how's it going everybody? Mopar Mike from Dover Dodge. I wanted to do a quick video on how to turn off the emergency braking on the uh, Uconnect 5 systems. This should work on any of our cars, Dodge, Chrysler, Jeep, Ram. Uh, there might be some slight you know, uh, variations, but overall, uh, what I'm gonna show you should work for you to at least get to where you need to be to uh, adjust those settings. So whether you wanna turn off the emergency braking or you wanna adjust the sensitivity, I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. So any questions, obviously reach out to me. Be happy to uh, you know help you guys troubleshoot, uh, but let's get into it. Alrighty, so when you first start your vehicle, you're gonna more than likely be on the home screen. Doesn't really matter which setting you are on though, because we're gonna go ahead and select the vehicle settings over here. Now you'll see you have controls and settings. We do wanna be on the settings tab over here. So if you are on controls, just go ahead and hit settings. You're gonna notice that you have additional options on the left-hand side. We wanna go ahead and select safety and driving assistance. Now you're gonna see we have options for automatic emergency braking, active lane management, and your blind spot. So my customer's asking how to turn off the emergency braking. So we're gonna go ahead and select that. Now you're gonna notice we have forward collision warning, forward collision sensitivity, and your pedestrian emergency braking. She was asking how to turn it off. So we would simply just hit off. And you're gonna notice your instrument cluster display says auto emergency braking off, and you get the little, you know, tab over there, also showing that that system is now off. You're also gonna notice that the pedestrian emergency braking is off over here. Um, that automatically turns off when that is selected. Um, if you wanted to just adjust the sensitivity, we could actually keep this on. We can turn that back on as well. Um, you'll notice when you do that, then that uh, little yellow uh, indicator turns off. Back over here though, you could adjust your forward collision sensitivity. When it's selected to far, that actually means that it's going to react when you're further away from the vehicle in front of you. So that means it's actually more sensitive. So if you want the system to be less sensitive and only react and uh, automatically apply the brakes uh, when you're closer to a car in front of you, then you're gonna wanna go ahead and toggle between medium and near. Um, Obviously, I don't recommend this is something that you test, um, but if you feel like um, it, the system is too sensitive for your liking uh, with it being uh, on the far selection, then you may wanna sw first try going over to medium. And obviously when a, a situation naturally occurs, if you think that is more appropriate for you, awesome. If you still think it's too sensitive, then maybe uh, try near. But obviously this isn't something you wanna be testing. So um, that is how you uh, go ahead and adjust your forward collision warning, whether you wanna turn it off or adjust the sensitivity. Any questions, reach out to me, moparmikenj.com or you can go ahead and shoot me a text, 973-970-8156.